It is Memorial Day weekend, which means many mid Michigan families will be heading to the great outdoors across the state. But there's one little thing to keep in mind. Michigan is seeing a big uptick in ticks. TV 5's Rachel McCrary tells us how to spot them to keep you, your family and your pets safe. It's, it's as worse as it's ever been. It's definitely worse than last year. Experts warn there's a growing tick problem in Michigan. One of the ticks can make you really sick if you're not careful. Ticks uh, have been increasing in the lower peninsula for several years now and you know, 20 years ago, there weren't that many ticks in the lower peninsula. Howard Russell is entomologist and studies insects at Michigan State University. He says both the American dog tick and the black legged deer tick are growing in numbers all around us. He isn't sure what's behind the increase, but says both the dog tick and deer tick can carry human pathogens. He says the deer tick even transmits Lyme disease. But if you do get bit, it doesn't always mean you'll get sick. If you find a, even find a deer tick and remove it before it's um, 48 hours, you've greatly reduced your chances of getting Lyme disease. Russell says this is because it takes about two days for the illness to transmit from tick to human. Symptoms of Lyme disease are fever, chills, fatigue, and sometimes a rash. So if you discover you or your animal has a tick on you, it's best to. Ah, oh, you should pull it off you, right? So grab it, use a pair of tweezers is the best way. Grab it right where it's attached to the skin and, and firmly pull it off. And Russell adds that you should wash your clothes after being in a wooded area and do a thorough tick check. This should also be done on any animals that were with you. You just have to be, you know, recognize that ticks are, are there and make sure you look for them when you get back. In Genesee County, Rachel McCrary, WNEM TV5.